Hi, this is a college of Fashion Science alumni, PG Department of Costume Design and Fashion, Ms. S. Sugastra, Assistant Professor. My subject name is Printing Technology. Now I am going to share my topic Introduction to Printing. Textile printing is the process of applying color to fabric in definite patterns or designs. In properly printed fabrics, the color is bonded with the fiber so as to resist washing and friction. Textile printing is related to dyeing, but in dyeing properly, the whole fabric is uniformly covered with one color. Varies in printing one or more colors or applied to it in certain parts only and in sharply defined patterns. In printing, wooden blocks, stencils, engraved plates, rollers or silk screens can be used to place colors on the fabric. Colorants used in printing cut and dyes taken to prevent the color from spreading by capillary attraction beyond the limits of your pattern or design. Traditional textile printing techniques may be broadly categorized into four types. Direct printing, in which colorants containing dyes, thickeners and the moderns are substance necessary for fixing the color on the cloth or printer in the desired pattern. The printing of a modern in the desired pattern prior to dyeing cloth the color adheres only where the modern was printed, resist dyeing, in which a wax or other substance is printed onto fabric, which is subsequently dyed. The waxed areas do not accept the dye, leaving uncolored patterns against a colored ground. Discharge printing, in which a bleaching agent is printed onto previously dyed fabrics to remove some or all of the color. The printing process does involve several stages in order to prepare the fabric and printing paste and to fix the impression permanently on the fabric. Pre-treatment of fabric, preparation of colors, preparation of printing paste, impression of paste on fabric using printing methods, drying of fabrics, fixing the printing with the steam or hot air for pigments. After process treatments, what is block printing? Block printing is a printing technique that uses a solid material to transfer ink into fabric. The block printing process involves engraving a design on the material known as the block, inking the design and then using the block as a stamp on the fabric. The resulting design will be a mirror image of the one on the block. The block may be a piece of wood, plastic or any other suitable material. No machine is required to do block printing, making the process an incredible hobby among artful Americans. Advantages of pr block printing The benefits of block printing include the following. The creative process of block printing allows you to make your own designs and patterns. You may block print multiple textiles with one block, but because it is printed by hand, each textile would be different from another, making it special and unique. Step 2. Printing. There are a couple of block printing techniques, but the one that we worked with is called Dabu. Dabu is a mud resist made by mixing together fuller's earth, gum and few other natural ingredients. It is mixed into a paste, not by hand, nor by a machine, but by food, just like grapes were crushed to make wine in the ester years. Once this paste is ready, the fabric is printed with a block using the dresses, the areas that are stamped dresses, any dye that the fabric is dipped in. Step 3. Drain. Such, in, such is crucial to this process. At every step, the fabric have to dry in the open fields under the sun. Step 4. Dyeing. After the fabric has been printed, it gets dyed. We work with dyes that are made with natural materials found in our surroundings such as floss, leaves, spices and various other natural metals. Below is an indigo vat that has been going on for several years. Step 5. Washing and drying. After dyeing, the fabrics get washed by hand. Thank you.